Tonight, we look at a Gene Simmons model kit from KISS. Coming up next on Monster Hobby's What's in the Box. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello, everybody. My name is Trevor Slescu, and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Well, here we go. We're going to open up the lid on our Gene Simmons model kit. This is the second model I have out of four, but I only have three of these great Destroyer Kiss model kits, figure kits. So now let's go down and check out the demon himself, Mr. Gene Simmons. All right, here is the second part of our Kiss video. We got Gene Simmons all ready to go from Polar Lights. And of course, there's the other figures that you can get. I am missing Ace Freely. So one day I'll do a review on it with him. But for now, let's look at the demon. So the first thing we've got here, again, is our instruction sheet. And as soon as you open it up, you can see some of the other cool models that are in here. Got Carl Casper's Undertaker Dragster, which I have in my own collection, which maybe one day I'll review. And there is how Mr. Simmons goes together. There's quite a lot of cool pieces, including those big, huge boots that he wears. The diorama and painting tips on how to paint them up, make them look good. Now let's see how this translates into plastic. Now in this envelope here, this plastic wrap, is the Destroyer background image which you can see in our review of the Paul Stanley kit because they're all the same. However, this part is not all the same. This is the great old plastic bag which I will now open. So here we go. Quite a lot of pieces in this kit as compared to the Paul Stanley kit. There we go. I suppose I didn't get to cut the bag open too much, but that's okay. So we have our display stand here, the rock base in multiple pieces, which will have to be glued together. But don't worry, they do give you this bottom so that you can fit them all in. Each one has a locator bit so it can fit to wherever it needs to fit. And then there's the top of the rock with that little cross in there for his foot, foot to fit in. <laughs> and there's those boots. I mean, look at the cool scale mail that are uh, on it. <laughs> I think this is his back piece. <laughs> Otherwise known as the booty. <laughs> and there's his other leg, which is supposed to be going up on the rock, I believe. Okay, we have a piece that has pronged itself in between here, so carefully try to get this out. There. This is a piece that holds the backdrop on and in place. Oh, dropping things. Okay, here is Mr. Gene Simmons right there. <laughs> and, um, these are the little demon bits that go on his boots. And there's the belt that he wears. Gene Simmons family jewels. Anyway, um, <laughs> yeah. Okay, and then there's his hair. Which is the back of his hair. There's his gloves with the studs on them. And I'm not sure what that is. But anyway, it will say in your instructions. Oh, it's part of his... yeah, okay. There's his chest, and there's the pieces that would go on it, like that. So that's his armor. More of his armor there. Okay, we've seen that. And then we've got his back and the arms here. So there you go. And the other arm, and some shoulder pads.
And that brings us to a conclusion of our review of the Gene Simmons Model Kit by Polar Lights. Well, we hope you enjoyed this look at the Gene Simmons Model Kit from the Destroyer set by Polar Lights. And if you would like to see some of our other great videos in this series, please check them out here and here. Check out our Monster Hobbies Build a Monster contest video down here from 2016. Same rules apply for 18. And don't forget to like and subscribe to us right here so we can continue to make these amazing videos. And until next time, uh, make sure you build your own future. Have a good one.